Hey there, my name is Tim Randall, the Director of Product Management here at Malili. Today, I'm going to walk you through how easy it is to reuse normalized names in multiple cases. Reusing normalized names can be a valuable tool for saving time when building privilege logs for a repeat client. So let's take a look. In this scenario, I'll be normalizing names in the workspace ABC Corp case, exporting the normalized names, and then importing them into a second workspace, GNR Corp case, which is for the same client with similar custodians. The first thing I'm going to do is normalize a few names in this case using the guided normalizations. After normalizing several names, let's navigate to the Manage Normalizations tab. Here we have a full list of all of the original values and the normalized names. To export these mappings, click the Export button, select Export All Data to CSV, the CSV contains all of the mappings in the case and can be imported into any other case, even across instances. I've navigated to the GNR Corp case where I've already run an analysis on the documents in the case. If we take a look at the project, we can see there are several names that are the same as the ABC Corp case. To automatically create normalizations for these names, I'll navigate to the Manage Normalization tab click on Import, select Browse, and then select the file that we created in the ABC Corp case. After upload, the mappings will be automatically imported into this case and immediately available. If I navigate back to the normalized projects, go into my project, and click on Normalize Values, and double click on Normalize Name, we can see that the mappings are automatically created and these are ready to write back to this case. And just like that, with almost no effort at all, we've normalized names in one case and imported them into a second case. This process and reuse of work product can save an incredible amount of time when working repeatedly with the same client. To get a demo of Chronicle or to try it out, let us know. Thanks for watching.